Hello everyone, this is Mike. Welcome to my channel, Mike the Tech Savvy. It's here, Android Oreo on the Samsung Galaxy S5 has arrived. We have here a Lineage OS 15 build. Here you go, Android version 8.0, Oreo based. With the August security patch level. You may have already noticed a weird red flickering around the border here. Of course the ROM is not a daily driver yet, but it's a very good thing that we have a Android Oreo build so soon. This means we will definitely have in the near future a more or less usable build. This one only has some things functioning basically most of the stuff isn't actually working I will give you a quick look at the installation procedure there's not much to look at you basically download the zip file that I've of course listed in the description you boot into TWRP recovery just like I'm doing right now First, make sure you wipe Dalvik system data and cache, like so. And afterwards, just go to install, select the Lineage OS 15 zip file and swipe to confirm flash. I've tried flashing an OpenGFs package, which works just fine with the S6 Lineage OS build but I didn't have any luck with it. It fails on the installation for the S5, so I've installed the ROM without it. Just to give you a quick update on the S6 Lineage OS 15, we have now a much more stable build. Keyboard no longer fails. Fingerprint is working. So it's more or less a usable build, let's say. I tried using it as a daily driver and yes, it got weird sometimes, so I needed to force reboot the device a few times, but we're on the good path. Hopefully the S5 version is just as fast in the development like its S6 brother here. So what we have working? Wireless LAN is working, the browser, of course, is working, I'll try to demonstrate it right now. Yep, it does work indeed, and it's quite fast actually. The keyboard has no issues, as it was the case with the first build of the Lineage OS 15 for the S6. The home button does not wake up the screen out of the lock screen. This is the case with the S6 build as well. You can only wake up the phone from the power button. Wake up the S6 as well. Okay. Initially, after installing the ROM, I had a camera app here in the app drawer but I no longer see it, so take it as it is. The camera and the flash do not work. You may have noticed that there is no Bluetooth logo here. Bluetooth is disabled for now. You cannot activate it. SIM card is not detected currently. I've been using this device, so it has a valid SIM card inside, but this ROM does not detect it. Of course, you've already seen the red flickering border. Yes, right now. This is an issue as well, but more or less only aesthetical. And yeah, one last thing is that I couldn't install any OpenGFs package. Therefore, I cannot install Google Play Store and check some other stuff. But I don't think it's really 
worth checking it. I mean, I don't think it's worth installing some benchmarking software because it's more or less not usable at this point. But I'm really confident. I hope that soon enough we'll have better builds. Stay tuned to my channel. I will review this ROM as soon as it improves in a way that makes it usable on a day-to-day -day basis. So this was it, a world first Lineage OS 15 build for the Samsung Galaxy S5. I've installed it on the international version. Let me know in the comments below if you have some other versions and I will tell you if it's compatible or not. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press the like button. If you'd like to see more similar videos in the future and you'd like to stay updated on the Lineage OS situation for the S5, S6 and of course I haven't forgot the S4 which should be getting a Lineage OS 15 version very soon now. Please do make sure to subscribe by clicking in the bottom left corner here. Of course, if you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comment box below. You will find the Lineage OS 15 zip file in the description of this video, but do try to install it only if you have a device to spare. Do not expect the device to be fully working. Once again, thank you so much for watching, I wish you a great day, until next time, bye!